year. This is amazing. An all-female rowing team will attempt to become the first crew ever to row 8,000 miles across the Pacific Ocean non-stop and unsupported and all for charity. Well, Miriam Payne, Jess Rowe and... Jess Rowe? Fantastic. And Brilliant. Lottie Hopkinson will travel from Peru in South America and not stop until they get to Sydney Harbour. Uh, to tell us more about this epic journey, they're here, fantastic. Really good to have you on. Miriam, Jess and Lottie. Jess, that's an amazing name, Jess Rowe. <laughs> um, why? I mean, this is for charity. We'll talk about that in a minute, which is incredible. And I respect you all so much for that. Why? I guess we can. So, so you've got experience in, in rowing. It's not just you just decided to do this. You've done similar things before. Yeah. So Jess and I met from rowing across the Atlantic Ocean. She did it as a four. I did solo. Um, Lottie's a learner rower, but catching up very yeah. quickly. <laughs> you rowed across the Atlantic on your own. Yes. And you've done it in a four. Yes. And you've just been on a river. Uh, I went on the river the first time last year, so we're very new to rowing. That's incredible. Yeah. It is. Absolutely incredible. So talk to me, how long is this going to take? Yeah. Up to six months, but hopefully not, not so long. So for six months, you're just going to be on the boat, or do you stop and get off? Just stay on no, the boat. Just on the boat. Yeah. For, six for six months. months. Yes. As long as we don't run out of food. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, and we might have to stop. So talk to me about food. What are you yeah. going to be eating during that six-month period? So we'll be eating freeze-dried food that you rehydrate with water. Um, so we'll have about 3,000 calories a day from that. And then the other um, two and a half will be snacks, so like chocolate, biscuits, quite unhealthy food, just to give us all the calories that we <laughs> so need. So about 5,500 calories a day in order Probably. to yeah. Yeah. survive. And storing all that in a boat that I think you said was 29 feet only, and you've got to sleep and you've... How does it fit in? I mean, this is I extraordinary. Think it's it's going to yeah. be like Princess and the Pea, but five yeah. layers of freeze-dried food. Yeah, yeah, quite. And yeah. you won't have any water on board with you. Is that right? How do you end up hydrating yourselves? So we've got a desalinator, a water maker machine, and that'll filter out the seawater, make it safe for drinking, washing, everything that we Amazing. need. It's uh, unbelievable. It is, isn't it? I know what you're going to ask now. Because <laughs> oh, well. if I did, if I asked, I'd be, I'd be slagged off. We've spoken about eating. We've yeah. spoken about sleeping. There's another Pooing. area. Let's just cut to the chase. How Pooing. do you go to the toilet? Oh, right, OK. It's just a bucket situation, Bucket sadly. and chuck it. <laughs> bucket yeah. and chuck it? Bucket and chuck you, it. You've got a nickname for your bucket, I believe. Is that right? Yeah, we do indeed. What's dumpy. his name? Dumpy. dumpy That's bucket. his nickname for me, to be fair. I think, to be fair, I, I, I need a dumpy behind this desk to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> getting to my age, I can't make it to the toilet. I'm um, on a serious note. I mean, can, can I also just say, I mean, it's extraordinary and what a challenge, but you are doing this for a charity that deserves a big shout out this yes. morning because one of the things, I mean, you're in a position where you can do this. Tell us about the Outward Bound Trust because I think this is fantastic. Yeah, so the Outward Bound Trust um, teach kids valuable life skills for adventures. So they have lots of residential places throughout the UK. Um, they'll try and partner with schools, especially 80% um, of their places are funded. So they really focus on trying to get kids that normally wouldn't have the opportunity, maybe due to financial means, on these courses, teaching them confidence, resilience, um, and just help setting them up for the future. I love the fact that you can take kids out of inner city areas who would never have that opportunity yeah. because of where they've been born or the situation they find themselves in to, to, to experience outdoor life. I think it's a really, really fantastic really idea. Is. I'm dying to know about I'm phones. dying to know if you've got space in your boat to take her with you. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? Well, I've got time. Um, how do you use phones? How do you contact friends That's, and family. They're rowing for charity. There'll be no internet. There'll be no WhatsApp. You're just going to be devastated. You can't do Will WhatsApp. Will you be able to use... Oh. oh. You haven't got Wi-Fi in the boat, no. have you? No. We have um, sat phones, satellite phones, um, and then we'll have um, a device that helps us send back photos and videos quite compressed, so it's quite limited. How do you fit we won't this be scrolling. How big no is scrolling. No scrolling. scrolling. So make sure it's quite simple. Is that 29 feet? How long is that? No, no 29, 29 feet. feet. They can <laughs> probably be, yeah, from here to, like... I guess the end of the studio. Maybe. Yeah, have you got right. sponsors for this, or are you, you, I mean, even you know you, you're raising money for the Outward Bound Trust, but is this sponsored? Have you got it sponsored? Working on it at the moment. Yeah, we've got some great sponsors so far. Fantastic. Um, that have yeah. really helped us to get to this point. And you, you won't be starting it for another year, but this is why you're coming on the show today mm. to talk to people about mm. what you're doing to try and generate some interest. I think it's absolutely fantastic. So do I. Is there a way that we can follow your progress as you'll be making this journey? So you said you'd be sending out photographs, etc. Do you have... I, I want to scroll Instagram for you right now. Will you have, a, like, a, a social media page? Yeah, so we've we've already got um, a TikTok page and an Instagram page. Fabulous. Um, so oh, website. So and the website as well, so... We'll have um, a social media manager 
who we send our footage to right. and they can put it on Keep for us. And how well do you know each other? Because yeah. I'm fascinated by just the three of you for six months. What if you have a falling out? You're going to have an argument, aren't you? <laughs> you have to. There's no way you can hide, though. I'm just happy I've got people to talk to this time. So. <laughs> yeah, I suppose if you've done it solo, I mean, then it must be nice. It's extraordinary. You rode across the Atlantic and you're now getting bored <laughs> flying over the Atlantic. It's extraordinary. Uh, listen, on, on a serious note, unbelievable. Um, if you are watching and listening and you're more interested, the Outward Bound Trust is a fantastic charity. And Miriam, Jess and Lottie, um, they want support, they want sponsorship, and so they should. They're doing a great, great job. And you sure you haven't got space in that boat? No. <laughs> I, I wouldn't want to weigh them down, Jeremy Kyle. <laughs> I don't I think you'd be a very good coxswain. <laughs> that That's thing? somebody that steers it. Um, I'm also, just really quickly, yep. you're going to be absolutely shattered from this. Yep. Um, yeah. <laughs> what, what kind of toll is this going to take on mm. your bodies? 15 hours a day, is that yeah, right? We'll be quite yeah. sleep deprived, so we might be rowing two hours on, two hours off, three on, three off, um, probably have a few different variations of our mm -hmm. routine. So will there only be two of you at a time rowing, is that right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. we've wow. only got two yeah. rowing seats. So. I just, I just yeah. honestly, I mean, and the other one, be, honestly, the other one will be having a poo asleep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that honestly right. completely delighted you came on the show. And <laughs> so anybody wonderful. watching that wants to be involved um, can go, uh, what's it called? Seize the day. Yeah. See what yeah. we've done yeah. there? S-E-A-S. -E we wish you the best of luck. Let us know how it goes. We'll certainly follow you, all right? Thank you so Thank much, you. Miriam. Thank you, gang. And Lottie, we wish you all the best.